How's it everybody and welcome to Psych Online Gaming. We are playing some more Dawn of War 3. And I'm Sigma. Yes, that is that is fantastic. Bro. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, so for this game, I decided to go with Eldar. Sigma stuck with his Sigmature orcs. If it's working, why fix it, Psych? Fair enough. And then, of course, we have an Eldar buddy. We're going up against a Space Marine and Eldar. And a Space Marine, so Blood it's Ravens. Blood Raven, Salamanders, and looks like uh, it's not Ultway, because Ultway is more white. I don't know, maybe a custom scheme. <laughs> All right, let's get this thing on the way, guys. Right, so, um, uh, the Eldar here at the bottom, obviously going to run down to this point. Going to try and claim it very fast, getting uh, quite a few Dino Avengers at the We're start. The Our uh, buddy over here. Our, that's you. Oh, it's... Uh, uh, oh, it's Boron or someone. Yes. yes. Okay, he's also getting a few uh, Dire Avengers. And yeah, there goes the Gretchen. Goes the Gretchen. Fantastic. <laughs> all right, you go past this point all the way to the middle. I want it. Yes, of course. I'm it not is. Build anything there, but I want it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like it's like so risky to build anything down there. That point is so hard to keep. Sorry. Yeah, it is. It's it's the hardest point. It's it's this point is the hardest point, and then right after that, it's this one or this one. Ah. They are quite tough, depending on on where you go. Now our enemy, the Salamanders, they are actually moving up here. They're going to go claim this point. Our buddy is not going to go after it, it would seem, at this stage. Which is an a interesting choice. Yeah, we're supposed to get two points each. Two points each! <laughs> yes, exactly. Exactly. Alright, so what do we have here? Here at the bottom we have uh, some Howling Banshees getting Already? ready for... Con yeah, he just went for the Altar immediately, uh, the Warrior Portal immediately. And he's just pumping out the Banshees for when he gets his uh, Striking Scorpions, one would presume. Alright, just placing the Dire Avengers on... Uh, Close enough so their fire can can arc, but at the same time just in a position so that uh, they can't just get Howling Banshee'd. And, okay, so the Howling Banshee's here in the middle, they're going to claim this point. They probably just assumed that we haven't claimed it yet. Uh, Allies having none of that. Oh yeah, no, he's having none of that. He's just going to shoot at them. Not doing too much, not doing too little. And they lay a trap. Uh, well, okay, I, I'm, okay. I'm not sure what they're doing, but I'm going up here to the hot cover <laughs> just to... Oh, okay, there we go, alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So do, they do go into the stealth. I'm surprised nobody saw them go into the stealth cover. You had like your army there and his army was... Yeah, he, he oh, saw him. Yeah, he saw him. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. I mean, he's waiting for school down. Yeah, he's pretty much not going to watch. But we do have the uh, Bone Singer coming in to try and claim that point though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they do want it, it would seem. I'm now. having none of that. Here, this Space Marine, the Blood Raven, he literally just put like a lot of heavy <laughs> weapons. It made it very hard for me to <laughs> try and do everything. Action in the middle. There, yes. What? Ah, oh, yes, yeah, okay. So you got ambushed by the Howling Banshees, and I remember you were like, Oh, Howling Banshees, no, I'm gonna die. And I'm like, Dude, just calm down, we're coming, we're coming. Fight, you say, Dude, fight, fight. We've, we've, got our, we've got our elder buddy, he's in coming over there. Uh, grenade into everybody. <laughs> <laughs> and then, of course, so, yeah, we're just gonna oh, clean him up over there. Here comes the Howling Banshee. I did spot this Banshee, but yeah, oh, unfortunately, I wasn't gonna I wasn't gonna catch up. So just going into the stealth cover a little bit over there. Um, but Interestingly enough, because we were up against um, two Space Marines... Um, no drop pods. Yeah, I haven't seen any drop pods <laughs> yet, which is quite interesting to note. And yeah, we're just pretty much running back, trying to secure our own location over here. Uh, got the listening post up, Bone Singer's gonna go drop the webway gate, and we've got the Warrior Portal up. How are things on your side, man? Alright, so... I'm building a boys out. <laughs> yes, fantastic. And you've got your war tower. You've got the three squads of boys, eh? Three squads of boys, uh, one shooter boy. That was the plan. Yeah, it looks like I it. wanted to get two squads of shooter boys, but apparently I misclicked. Ah. <coughs> that's why we use hotkeys. <laughs> okay, our allies on like four squads of Dire Avengers. He really likes those blue guys. He apparently does, yes. Okay, three squads of Howling Banshees is really tough to go up against with three squads of uh, Dire Avengers. Uh, Howling Banshee squad is coming out. Um here at the bottom okay so our, our buddy is moving down he's gonna try and see if there's anything he can see okay so here's some mounting benches the striking scorpions have just dropped in oh that's quick yeah well mine has also just dropped in there we go with our howling <laughs> badges squad so yeah we are firing at them nah they were a bit ballsy oh that grenade unfortunately <laughs> could not connect 
Uh, okay, oh. he does the stealth thing. I actually wanted to run away. I don't know why I went in there, but oh, yeah, all right. So there we go. We, we did get caught out there a little bit, but yeah, we've got our own Big striking scorpions fight. here. We've got some uh, uh, howling oh, batches of our means. own. There comes the Space Marine drop pod with the kill oh. team. And at this point in time, I was like, screw it, I'm moving these. There's I've got like two, two kill them. teams down here and some striking scorpions. This oh, is pretty that's, that's insane. That's not good. But we do have Sigma coming in and we do have our buddy coming in here. With all so, his freaking... Yeah, oh. so that's not too... Uh, okay. Oh, okay. I actually, I actually thought he was gonna... Um, like, I actually thought he did damage here. Uh, when I saw the battle, the state of the battle, but apparently he didn't actually do damage. He just ran. Um, he drew away the banshees. Yeah, he just drew away the banshees, which is fine. But that would explain why I was support. <laughs> yeah. That All right, <laughs> that was a that was a good one. All right, he's not gonna make it out. I can't see that happening. Nope. Okay, that's fine. And then of course we had some tactical squads up here. I wanted to go around and just see if I couldn't get in there. Ah, uh, uh, well. Uh, poo happens, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here we go. We just barge in I there a little, a little bit. Yeah, of course, man. And then as long as their shields hold, they're tough. But once their shield drops, they die very quickly. Uh, okay, okay. So I got in there. I did my jump. I did a bit of damage, and then we just pretty much stealthed out. Uh, okay, okay. Yep. So they do make it out, and then yeah, we're just gonna try and distract them a little bit with the banshees, and then we are running away. Here in the middle, we have a fight. There's some striking scorpions and some howling banshees. And orcs. all right, okay, <laughs> and orcs. Is so we're many feeling, orcs. Uh, we're feeling pretty good. We've got, we've got the numbers. We've got the numbers. Yeah, you you do have the numbers. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, it's something interesting to note is we should have pushed on this point like really a lot earlier. Uh, but it's okay. It's okay. It's not the end of the world. <laughs> Here we can see our Eldar buddy has basically taken this hot cover or he's about to get it. And yeah, it's uh, it's it seems everybody is slightly reluctant at this point in time to just, to just push out. So we're getting the uh, the soul shrine here for the upgrades. We're getting the webway gate. We've got the warrior portal here over on your side. You've oh wow, oh, I misclicked. <laughs> All right, there we go. Okay, so you've got uh, Daka hut. You've got a uh, war tower, a second war tower, and then your boy's hut. Uh, were you going for like the looters here? Oh, they, they come later. <laughs> oh, okay. At the moment, I'm just um, spamming uh, Shooter Boys. I uh, like okay. those guys. Yeah, Shooter Boys, once they've looted, and you've got the... Um, I've got the... Um, tons of bombs. Tons of bombs, yeah, there we go. Tons of bombs. Then, yeah, they're actually surprisingly good. Uh, here, okay, so I sent in the Bone Singer just to scout out what was happening, but we there's a lot of... Green of guys. Yeah, there's a lot of salamanders here and more of them coming. So I was about to push out and then I thought against it. <laughs> um, yeah, from what I can see, they already have the plasma weapon. So that's also Jeez. pretty good. Yeah, they'll they'll be able to do some good damage over there. Uh, these guys are... Yeah, your shooter boy still. Okay, so here we've got about three squads of Dire Avengers. Uh, one squad of Howling Banshees, one squad of Striking Scorpions. And uh, just we, are, for a fight again. we are itching for a fight. We really want to kind of like get out there, but at this point in time, because well, it's we've got the medal, so we've got the the points. Yeah, I should have gone. Elite points. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, this is rough. Oh, this is that's rough. That's a big squad. All right, so yeah, uh, we we do see them. We do run into them. Howling Banshees getting in. They're actually doing significant amounts of damage that to their first Howling Banshee squad. Um, Exactly. I'm oh, just pinging for, for defend. Oh, so yes, our yes. buddy is coming in with his Hounding Banshees and with his stuff. Unfortunately, we were not 100% coordinated here. But we do run into the back of them here. And uh, yeah, we are gonna we are gonna do a bit of damage, but not too much. Here, there's a, there's like heavy bolters He's in here the already. Yeah, there. and that's that's pretty hardcore. Uh, so we, we need to run away. But this, unfortunately, has just turned really bad really fast. Uh, yeah, the orcs are coming <laughs> in. Well done. <laughs> there we go. So the orcs are uh, actually part of this fight right now. Uh, and that prompts the Eldar to turn around and oh, try and support. But there we go. There's another kill team coming uh, up. This heavy weapon support here. That ex explains why they came down onto this location. Uh, uh, like what? Like two or three times by now? Tactical. It's mostly just because of the heavy weapons that's uh, positioned up there. Taking on this position here or this position is a significantly harder. You don't have that like support. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so yeah. I would, I would almost have to say this is the oh, is, this is the best point of attack on the <coughs> entire map. They have now pushed uh, everybody back. They still have like uh, a few good good units, pretty damn strong. Here we've got uh, like three Dire Avengers and a 
uh, Dark Reaper squad. It's not going to be enough if they do decide to push in over here. The Salamanders really haven't moved yet. Um, they they've like they've dropped some drop pods in here. Oh, it's, uh, a, it's a defensive player. <laughs> got, got some guys in there. Okay, our allies got two squads of Howling Batches down here. So here we go, guys. This is a fairly big push. Yeah, it's not and work. this was like, I, I I thought I attack moved, but I didn't. I actually oh, right clicked. Yeah, right I ran, them. and then I ran right into them, and that's gonna, gonna cost more. me a dire avenger squad immediately. That costs me uh, a lot of damage just going. So here, at this point in time, you kind of want to just split your guys up as much as you can, cause them to run, you know, as far as they uh, like really far every every time they do something. But yeah, it's just not <laughs> yeah, gonna happen. Like I need help. <laughs> yeah, I was like, okay, well, guys, this 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 location is lost. Um, we do have the Eldar buddy. He's coming in, but he also really he just doesn't have enough to uh, support this position right now. So we've got uh, the, we've got the warrior portal warping away. We've got the soul shrine warping away. This we unfortunately we have to lose, and this hasn't been upgraded yet, so it can't warp. Uh, he did bring his uh, warp spiders to come in here and oh, to do some damage. Yeah, it was about at this time when I realized he never clicked this damn thing, <laughs> so I had to buy it. <laughs> it was pretty annoying. I just lost like everything, and, and I had to buy the damn point. And now I, I still have to buy the damn point, <laughs> which is freaking annoying. Um, well, they brought their portals, and now they can. We, go. Yeah, we went like like too far behind. These guys are coordinated. But we were, yeah, we were a fair amount uh, behind right now on the elite point. So there, finally, I need to buy it, which is very expensive at this point in time. The more. Uh, points you build, the more expensive they get. So yeah, I was predicting I was the base. Pretty <laughs> damn expensive. You were predicting your base. Oh no wait, you were predicting the base. There yeah, we go. Yeah, All yeah. right. I was, I was right. I was worried that they were um, going to continue their push. Yeah, Sigma being the team player that he is. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, so here we go. He's going to run into these amounts of orcs who immediately break cover once they see an enemy. Watch it. Look at it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, what the hell? I was looking at this happening and I was like, dude, what did you just do? <laughs> like, like you stand in the hard cover until the enemy comes, at which time you jump out of the hard cover and uh, you take on the enemy. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Okay, so you've got your storm boys storm back. Boys we've got some back. warp spiders here. We've got some striking scorpions, and uh, yeah, you've got confident again. you've got like significant bodies here. So we might as well. And I think they actually saw that we were going to push back, so they oh, pretty much just ran, ran with everything. Yeah. I think this cooldown was yeah. This thing was still on cooldown. Oh, so, that's what happened. Um, I don't think they were able to jump it away. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. We're gonna be in time. We're gonna be on time to get this. So seven seconds, six seconds, and then also for the actual jump time, it's quite long. So yeah, this building is definitely That's going down. There <laughs> we go. Fantastic. And then of course we're gonna blow up this thing, and we're gonna reclaim the point. And our buddy came with oh, a a gazillions of <laughs> dire <laughs> avengers. Uh, but when they saw that we did defend at the bottom quite quite hard, uh, they do run up here to try and do some damage. Uh, here with the Howling Banshees, with the Striking Scorpions, and but some... Now, now we know where they are. But some Dark Reapers. So, the ally buddy, he does run up here. We've got a Webway Gate over here, so they are sp uh, sped up slightly. He's got a Webway Gate over there he as well. He loves his bombs. He does love his bombs. He loves his Dire Avengers. And, uh, yeah, so um, here he kind of has to engage. Otherwise, nothing's going to happen. I do bring my Striking Scorpions. At this point you of the game... charge it. I can. At this, point of the, <laughs> <laughs> at this point of the game, dude, they're already kind of redundant. Like, they're not that good anymore. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So look, look at them running now. Now he's right clicked on there. So all your orcs do all their damage <laughs> until the last striking scorpion dies, at oh, which point wow. they engage in combat. So so yeah, you were able to do a lot of damage. I actually lost majority of my army here oh, again. Against the thing. Yes, that's correct. And uh, but I do have like oh, uh, one squad of dark reapers here at the back still. Big fight against the Eldor. But there's like a gazillion, there's a gazillion. dire <laughs> avengers that's gonna come in here as well, and we do mop them up, so that's pretty good. I think that was roughly like I don't have the numbers anymore. <laughs> yeah, but yes, 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 yes. But but at this point in time, that was like a good, oh geez, that's a big army. Good circumstance for us. We did manage to get rid of the Eldor. Oh, I'm so sorry, guys. It's getting late here. <laughs> um, we did get rid of um, a fairly big portion. Oh wow, they just took a lot of shield damage there. Um, we did get rid of a big portion of the Eldar army, so that's good. Now it's only space marines left, and he's just still got his Dire Avengers, which is funny. Uh, I'm bringing the Ortark up. He's finally coming oh, to the game. Ortark. And I'm just leaving him in the south cover. They were so crazy about coming through here the whole time. Oh, okay. I thought if they are going to come through here and, and we kind of box them in somewhere in a small space, I could yeah, just yeah, yeah. grab them all in and grenade them. Do the plasma rain Do of death. Do the plasma rain this of death. This guy isn't very death. responsive. 
No, he's kind of chill. He's like doing his own thing. Yeah. Um, he but he is so bored though. <laughs> but he is guarding the point, so I guess that's not like the. Oh come on. <laughs> it's not like the worst thing he could have done. It's probably not the best, but it's definitely not the worst. Oh yeah, I get you, I get you. And uh, right, look at this. Jeez. And I told you, man, this guy just loves the Star Avengers. So we finally get the Sky Portal up. Ah, that's a good one. And, uh, yeah, so once the Sky Portal comes up, once you get a Falcon... You rushed for um, that one, Psych. No, I didn't rush. It's like just... three units. <laughs> yeah, I know, but it's like 15 minutes in, dude. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's not that bad. I just <laughs> lost everything. Okay, finally the Salamander decides Big he's going to push out, but he's got like three, four oh, Plasma Squad, the plasma. Kill Team, and three Heavy Bolters. I have to retaliate. Yeah, the orcs will have I to got my buggy. <laughs> There we go, you do drop your guys right on top of them. Big taunt going off over there. Uh, we do have a enemy drop pod coming in with a freaking Terminators by now. That's oh, is that what ridiculous. It was? Yeah. <laughs> nah, dude. Kitchen. Nah, dude. I'm no. launching everything. <laughs> I can see that. And the kitchen sink. <laughs> Alright, okay, here comes a butt ton <laughs> of, <laughs> of, uh, <laughs> of the Iron Major. Uh, the auto arc is here. Oh, he's doing so, yeah, he is doing damage in there. He's doing uh, damage all over the place. He is going to jump up pretty soon when we spot the Terminators to get to them pretty quickly. Uh, so, yeah, there he goes. He's going to like drive right into them there, and he's going to attack on the Terminators here. It's a fight that he will win um, if they stay in melee. Yeah, no, he will rip them apart if they stay in melee. Uh, they do teleport back, uh, trying to just do some sort of damage. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, but yeah, no, the well, Eldar and yourself, you're basically just going after the mirror and... Oh, yeah. <laughs> dude, you're launching... What the hell, dude? <laughs> I'm launching anything, Did I can, you? <laughs> anything I can get my hands on for that stun lock. <laughs> Did you even, like, pay attention? Like I just launch anything and everything. Like, do you even? <laughs> uh, okay, but in response, they do charge down here uh, with okay. the Blood Ravens, and they are doing very a lot. Look at this heavy bolters, Jeez. man. That's a lot. If he, he actually, dude, if he invested that amount of money, like half of it, into last cannons, he would be unstoppable <laughs> right back now. Uh, so the Autark is moving around. He's just checking uh, all by himself. Yeah. That, that's that's what he's good at just just running around and trying to pick off things here and there um, but yeah he does realize he's gonna have to come down at some point the Falcon is now finished that's good this is a big shift in power considering that nobody at this point in time has gone for vehicles yet everybody has kind of been stuck on oh, infantry yeah, tech infantry. good crash good crash like. <laughs> yeah 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 so everybody's pretty much stuck Autark is coming down he's gonna come down and support this battle here but they are gonna turn around the second they see the Falcon <laughs> they're like nope I want none of that I want none of that. I want none of that. I want none of No, no, leave me alone and check it, check the setup. Oh, no. They're just like waiting for a mirror. Oh, this was brilliant. actually really brilliant. All Tark also coming in here. So, oh, yeah. Awesome. Uh, and there we go. So, uh, oh, we get the storm. There's, there's, uh, there's our Eldritch Queens going down. There's Ooh. a couple of people getting drawn in. And we're going to drop some grenades on top of their head. Oh, it doesn't cluster them no, anymore. No, it doesn't cluster them anymore. They, they said it was a bit too overpowered. Oh, okay. So, you kind of like have to run after them. And then we just jump in and finish it off. So, here. Okay, guys. We've pretty much cleaned up the entire oh, Blood Raven army. army. Yeah. Uh, if there's, and we're gonna kill the warrior portal again. And Gabriel Angelos is gonna go down. Oh, he's gonna take it. Uh, yeah, yeah, he's not gonna make it. Nah, he will never make it. Right, so here we go. We've pretty much now got. Um, I think we. I think we're pretty much in a good spot now. Yeah, yeah. Like, I'm like pushing up. I'm pushing from up. now on out, we're in a good spot. So, uh, so yeah, you're pushing up here. Um, he really has nothing here to defend with, um, except for those guys. But they can't they shoot. Can't shoot through the slab yeah all right but you are pushing up you are going to do some damage today we have claimed this point though it should be noted and yeah. oh dude on a, t on a tower really <laughs> from the truck okay that's a freebie <laughs> That's fine. Okay, that's fine. That makes it okay. <laughs> All right, then that's just gonna kill the uh, the power and the uh, resource the requisition generators. That's pretty good. All right. Dude, I'm gonna push down. All right, you're gonna push down. That's fantastic. I'm gonna push down. Dude. Uh, Eldar, uh, uh, ally Eldar, just like positioning. Um, somewhere on the map where <laughs> he feels like he could be useful uh yeah and we are pretty much just positioning over here trying to see if we can't break the shield down you are still claiming the point oh here we go i'm gonna push down <laughs> okay so the elder oh dude if he dropped like a w there ish he could have killed everything <gasps> oh no he did no, oh that's horrible <sighs> so that's what happened ah but he didn't kill too much to be honest 
Yeah, yeah you didn't I'm, kill all that I'm much. I'm going away. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I can't take on a Titan at okay. this moment. Okay. Uh, but now that we do have the tanks and all of this fanciness and whatnot, uh, there we go. Autor oh, jumping geez. in, just disrupting as much as we can. Throwing the wind right on himself and then running through it. Oh, he's got Rave Guard. Yeah, our enemy has got Rave Guard, but it's cool. The Falcons and the Dark Reapers can't take care of them. Oh, and yeah, the Autark yeah, yeah. is pretty tough. His shield was full. Um, so yeah, he's gonna be happy. <laughs> comes, it comes all the dire Avengers. Dire Avengers war. There, yeah, the two Falcons still going I'm like, strong. Dude, they have a they're Titan gonna, on top. <laughs> they're gonna do some damage. I'm like, dude, ignore the Titan. We're gonna get a shield <laughs> generator for this, and a relic point generator. So we're just positioning up here, and these Dark Reapers are gonna like really rip them a new one. Uh, yeah, that's that's actually not too. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. All right. All Dark pulling away, so we don't get into range over there. Uh, this listening post has to die. Once this listening post dies, we can obviously focus on the. They're just gonna run off from here. That's pretty. That's pretty. Yeah, I noticed that happening, but I I, I don't know why he did that. <laughs> All right, so he's also got like a couple of uh, wraith god that's now popped out, and uh, yeah. Those are some brave Look at these wolf spiders, man. They're, they're just like ah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, gonna take well, well, Angelos. actually, they've been stunned by the turret. They've been stunned. Oh, they're gonna uh, Angelos attack. And Angelos. Oh, no, oh, yeah. Can they teleport out? They Will they to, make it Angelos out? I'm not sure. Mm, yeah, he yeah, makes it out. Hey, you got one out. Okay, but this shield generator will die. There's just like nothing that would be uh, we able got a to shield do. Generator. So we do get the shield generator, which helps with power. <laughs> um, <laughs> we've been struggling with, to be honest. Um, power is so difficult to come by. Yeah, I'm, uh, but that does kick me into gear, so I can get tier three, which is really good. Excellent stuff. Yeah, that's good. So some rates got to be uh, this Eldor player, man. He had like a little of everything everywhere. everywhere. <laughs> uh, yeah. All right. So there's a resource point, but they. It's, it's like my army's in the cover, and the moment he just walks out, they just... Oh, I don't know why they thought they should... These tanks are, like, not in the cover. Why are they not just shooting? <laughs> Nobody knows. They, they're just standing there trying to, like, sneak and hide and whatnot. Oh, we're getting the points. Uh, but, yeah, we are going to get those points. Uh, not too much he can do here. He's done a lot of damage to our elbow. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. This is Ooh. incredible. Oh, he does the combo. Mm -hmm. ah, and he just melts. He melts yeah, they're they kind of stuck here now. Uh, trying to teleport away. These guys just popped out, so yeah, they're oh, gonna is, is they're gonna his, end up dying. That's his thing. Yeah, this is our allies' thing. This is the enemy's thing. Can you take on that Titan? Um, right now, with what I have, no. <laughs> no. I wouldn't risk it, uh, <laughs> to be honest. But I am gonna take on the Dreadnought. No, he can't shoot back. Oh, okay. There's not much he's gonna be able to do. So I'm just like shooting until I realize he's coming, and then I'm just Eldrick winzing and running. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. Oh, I didn't even get it off. It seems. <laughs> yeah, that's that, that's. Yeah, my, nice. my Bone Singers unfortunately died. They were here to uh, <laughs> repair yeah, that, the tanks. That, that early Titan is quite a deterrent, so. Yeah, no, it is. Oh, but but it doesn't necessarily mean you're going to win. All right, so again, you have recently discovered how much you enjoy killer cans. <laughs> yeah, you wanna, uh, do you want to tell the viewers at home they about are that? Cheap enough. They are cheap enough so I can build them because I couldn't build Drift Death Threads and I build them from scrap mostly. Hmm. Okay. And my scrap piles aren't big enough. But they just, really are pretty like good. They, the they Titan scared me so much, I just mm. got a whole lot of uh, killer cans and uh, tank, uh, tank busters. Yeah, the killer cans will actually do well against them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. They, they, they're they really good at that kind of damage. Um, Alright, so the... I'm pushing up again! The Biltan has now fallen back, just <coughs> trying to get this guy healed up a little bit. Um, the uh, Sky Portal... Yeah, alright, so we finally tech swap to... Um, uh, Spectros as well. So yeah. Uh, oh wow. Yeah, you got the top part as well. Yeah, you got the point. But now nobody's here to defend because everybody was down here. Because they were thinking, nah, we, nah, nah they're gonna come back. No, <laughs> no, no we're not. To, no. no, we're not. They have to slog it all the way up. Yeah, pretty Again. much. All right. So some uh, a good amount of wraith guard here oh, for wow. our ally. Um, he's been pumping them out pretty pretty well. Also I think I think that's Avengers. also why you wanted to go for the Dire Avengers. It gives them a lot of power built up oh, okay, uh, to okay. get like a lot oh, of Wraith Guard see, right see. when you get the pick. And uh, yeah, all right. So Spectre's coming out. Two Falcons being out. Yeah, we, I think I think we're in a good position here. I'm pushing down. And you are pushing down now. Um, okay, the Eldar has popped down his building here already. He is repositioning. Well, he seems to know that I'm. Oh. Uh, he seems to know what my plan is. I would say so. I, th I actually think that he kind of has a good idea. Uh, here we've got the Terminators coming in. They're going to meet up with the Eldord, though. I mean, they, 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 I don't think they're going to get far. Uh, all right, you've already pushed down that point. So big fight coming down here. Uh, these Terminators are going to down. We've got an Eldrick Storm coming down. Uh, unit jumped into it. So this is obviously <laughs> the enemy Eldrick Storm. 
There we go. All right. Oh, so now he's got, got a thing in it. Yeah, now he's got this thing, which is pretty scary, because it does a lot more. It does a lot more damage, but oh, it also it slows, slows a lot more. Yeah. I'm so. just running what Jeez, look at the range on that thing. Mm. Yeah, it's all the way up to there. Wow. That it slows. It doesn't do as much damage. This is the damage. But oh, it slows okay. like all over the place. It, it, it does help it to I'm catch just up trying well. To run away. Yeah, no, you're not gonna run away right now. <clears throat> oh, he's got a lot of Wraith Guard here. Oh, um they can do okay if they don't just get pulled in and oh wait, is this accidentally gonna hit them? Oh, oh crap, that's unfortunate because he wanted to hit there. Oh. Uh, but yeah, he also got a few of them, which is pretty pretty bad. Uh, the the Eldar here, we're trying to move up, uh, trying to get into a supporting position, but then uh, we took a big hit. <laughs> yeah, we we did kind of like realize there was some people running through here, so that became our target. So again, Autar jumping up, and I'm just like dropping grenades. I don't, I'm not even Eldrick winging winging anymore. I'm just like dropping grenades on things that are like problematic. And, and smash. boom, that's fun. And then after that, if there's time, we'll do a win. Um, I think it was roughly at about this time. Yeah, there we go. Okay, first fire, fire prism has now popped up. Uh, these space marines are also going to turn around and come and face this Eldar. <clears throat> they kind of want to be part of whatever is happening here. So they do get to the Spectres um, and the Dark Reapers, unfortunately. But we are just going to literally turn and fight them. Uh, Titan just became available. Didn't cost it immediately, but will cost it soon. This Ooh. Wraith Knight actually moved in quite far. Oh, wow. Is that knobs? Is that... Oh, no. That's uh, your storm boys. All right. So these Space Marines are taking heavy losses. And it does look like they're going to end up dying up here from, from the Eldar army. And here, the Eldar... They have run away? Titan's run away, yeah. All right. Okay. So the Titan has run away. Just as I was about to stun lock him. Ah, yes. Of course. Uh, but I couldn't... Um, uh, I didn't know which way you went, so uh, go, just go, pretty go. much just left it there. <laughs> uh, our ally does have his Titan out now, so he's yeah, just immediately start. dropped him down here, and he's gonna like just walk up and down and uh, <laughs> look really, really cool. I think he's actually going off to this turret like directly. Oh, that's, pretty, that's pretty ballsy. Yeah, pretty ballsy. I mean, you can, of course, and he would win that fight, uh, but the at the same time, yeah. All right, so he's busy fighting there now. The uh, Eldar are moving in here. This guy does, uh, uh, he's going to be a big problem. I do have my Titans. Well, this Fire Prism barely escaped that madness. <laughs> okay, with these guys. Oh, but, now our, but now our Titan is here as well. So he's going to end up, st he's going to start shooting. This guy's going to start shooting. So I'm shooting off the W, but unfortunately he can just walk out of it. So I don't want to just waste my ability on a Titan that's kind of like running away. But he is, he, he has taken a lot of damage. Oh, but he is in. jumping away. I can't get to him. So now we can basically just blast the down venerable the Venerable Dreadnought here. Alright, <laughs> that's fun. Okay, look at that amount of damage. Yeah, that's cool. Every time you see that little icon pop up against his head, that's from the Fire Prism shot that silences him. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. It's another one. Boom. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, so he's just shooting at him, Yo, and he's, he's trying to, like, run away and get away from this. Uh, you, you've got a lot of stuff moving up. <laughs> so, yeah, he's trying to get away. You see him. <laughs> yeah, I do, actually. Um, but I, I can still see him. Um, so I'm just like giving him false hope really and then just shooting him to death. <laughs> oh, that was such a stylish move. Which was like so sick. This guy just went... <laughs> and then he came back and that was it. So yeah, okay. So this is a Shadow Spectre's coming out. We do have a Fire Prism here. We do have Orc support, ladies and gentlemen. They are coming in here thick and fast. So many Orcs. Yeah, just so many freaking Orcs. And uh, yeah, we've got more guys now just piling in. And yeah, blood is on the water, right? We 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 smelling blood. This is this has got to be close to the end. Uh, just doing nice damage here to all of their resource points. Orcs are moving in. They're going to claim the hard cover just so they can run out of it the second <laughs> enemies pop up, which is going to be fantastic. Uh, this Titan, this color scheme actually makes the Titan look really freaking cool. Yeah, yeah, oh, I like it. This is cuck, but this is cool. <laughs> <laughs> I, <agree. laughs> I went for an Afrikaans word so that I can't get censored. <laughs> Um, and yeah, okay, so this shield generator is just not going to make it. We've got uh, an additional falcon that's popped up now after we've lost ours because that gives an additional resource. Uh, a re... What do you call it? Uh, 
reinforcement platform, really. <laughs> uh, except for the truck and the Titans. Um, the Titans gonna tank it. Yeah, and here we go. So I'm I'm trying to tell Sigma I'm just gonna go blow this stuff up so we can dismantle them like, piece by piece. And he's like, dude, I wanna get a tower. <laughs> tower. At least this guy was listening. He's like, oh, all right, I'll I'll, go, I'll come blow that crap up. I wanna kill a tower. Uh, but we do end up kind of like facing off against the last cannons and Ooh, stuff. That's gonna hurt. Uh, here in the hard cover. Uh, but the Spectres, Spectres, believe it or not, they're, they're actually not that bad against this hardcover. They, just give it a little bit of time and then you'll see it. It's actually going to go fairly, you can see there, it goes reasonably fast considering it's like that hardcover. Uh, fire... Look at the truck, look at the truck. What, where? <laughs> oh, good hit, there we go, alright, cool, cool, cool. Uh, yeah, there goes the Titan. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Must eat the Oh, that That's was a, a pretty good, good shot. I was hoping I could make use of that shot and pull all of these guys into these that spot there, but it didn't really work out. Uh, and the Spectres kills everything <laughs> before the Titan game. Bad Spectres, bad. You make Titan look bad. Alright, so our buddy is still running around. He's got his Wraith Lord out now as well. And yeah, we're pretty much just here by the end. Um, I don't think they have anything left to fight. Oh wow, okay, he's there as well. So yeah, they had like literally nothing left to fight us with and we've just and dismantled them blow up the like piece by piece. Uh, yeah, and that's gonna be it. That's, that's gonna be it. That's just it. This was cool guys. Um, having so much fun playing this game again. It's, it's <laughs> yeah. pretty hardcore. Although, although in comparison to the other games that we've been playing recently, this thing is hot. Hectic. Eh? <laughs> it's like so hectic. It's so much to do all the time. So fast, yeah. I'm not used to it anymore. Alright, guys, but uh, we did manage to get a screenshot of uh, the scores by the end. So, a 30 minute game. Uh, Sigma got 90 kills, 93 and 108 for our buddy. So, Sigma killed six elites. I killed seven. Our buddy killed uh, two. As far as uh, objective damage goes, Sigma did. 34% of the total damage, I did 43, and our buddy did 22. And the MVP for this game um, that? on our team was the Autark, clocking, oh. clocking in with 22 kills. 22 kills? Yes. Yeah. That's, that's not the insane 70 it's, in the it's, past. It's not the, the badass Autark from the <laughs> past anymore, but it's still good. It's still something. Yeah, and then because this guy saved up so hard for that Wraith, uh, Wraith Knight, God, so <clears throat> he was the MVP on their team with 85 kills. Jeez. Yeah, it's pretty hardcore. That's a lot of kills. And uh, it's pretty cool uh, 200, checking. 248 kills overall. We. The guy with the Wraith Knight, the Titan. This guy. No, that guy. That oh, guy. Yeah, 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 no, he killed a lot, dude. But I think he killed a lot of orcs, really. <laughs> uh, this guy not doing all that well. This guy performing pretty well. But you can see here that we ended up going for more specialized troops. Uh, well, we uh, more well, no, they went for like more kind of like specialized stuff. We went for more like generic stuff initially. That's why their kill count is so much higher. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. But yeah, we kind of went for the resources and then we just dismantled them piece by piece. Pretty much, pretty much. Yeah, which is pretty good. But there we go, guys. So that is another Dawn of War three game that we've actually been playing here with Sigma. Um, yeah, if you like, if you like this video, guys, hit that like button. If you like the content on my channel, hit that subscribe button. If you hit the subscribe button, remember to click that little bell icon. That'll give you notifications whenever something new comes up. Look at that little little twitchy fire there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's going to be it for me, guys. Anything for me? I miss this game. I do miss this game. <laughs> yeah, it's so much fun. And, and we've actually not struggled too much to find games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's It's been reasonable. It has been reasonable. Even though it just practically did. There's a few di diehards out there. <laughs> yeah, it would seem so. It would seem so. But okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. That's going to be it from us. We're going to see you guys for the next recording. But until then, bye-bye.